Hey friends, today I'm hanging out at the Lakeland Antique Mall. I've seen a lot of photos people have been tagging me in with some amazing Disney World props and even some awesome cast costumes. So I decided to come down, make a little video, and give you guys a peek see. Anyways, let's go do this. I visit here quite frequently, maybe every two, maybe three weeks, and I come down and make a little video to show you all the cool Disney World props and Polynesian furniture, stuff like that, so that maybe you can actually buy it if you're looking for it. If you do see anything in the video that you're actually interested in, you can actually call the Lakeland Antique Mall here and you can purchase it like over the phone and they'll put it to the side for you. And you can even like, you know, set up a U-Ship, uh, one of those companies actually come pick it up and ship it to you. And I'll put all of the information in the description below, like their, their address and the phone number. Anywho, let's get to the good stuff, huh? And the first thing I wanna show you is the complete Tower of Terror cast member costume. How amazing is that? You can actually purchase this and wear it. That blows my mind. It comes with a shirt, pants, hat, coat. That is a huge collectible item. It's expensive, but it's very hard, very hard to come by one of those. I feel like the Haunted Mansion and the Tower of Terror are the probably most sought after cast member outfits. I mean, I can only imagine what a Haunted Mansion one would cost, but a Tower of Terror one, that is awesome. And it looks like they have tons of the Polynesian lamps actually in stock. Wow, they have so many of them. I'm so excited because you know these are very popular right here. Ooh, and I see something else peeking up over here that's really awesome. These props, I don't know where they're from though, but it's Hercules and Pegasus. That's really awesome, they're huge though. I mean. They are huge. I don't know what they could be from though. If you guys know what these are from, please let me know in the comments because I think that is awesome. I love Hercules. And take a look at all of the Polynesian stuff over here. These are all of the tiki lamps from the rooms. Tons of these, tons of mirrors, tons of desk. This is awesome. If you guys like the Polynesian, oh, that is awesome. Wow. This is literally all Polynesian and Hercules and Pegasus. Ooh, they even have the big mirrors too. I'll try to show you guys the prices of things actually on the video, but if you, like I said, see something you like and you wanna know how much it costs, all you have to do is just call the Lakeland Antique Mall, describe it to them, and they literally will tell you how much it costs. For instance, these tiki lamps are $250. I think that's well worth it because of the rarity of them. So once these ones are actually all gone, and these ones are sold, that's it. Like, I don't know how much more they're gonna be getting, but like after this big round of renovations, they're not gonna be making these styles anymore. I'm gonna start looking through now everything. This is the Vault Collectibles booth. And like I said, both booths actually, they're right next to each other, have like all amazing things and a little bit of different stuff in each one. That's what I like about it because there's like a big, you know, variety going on. Now, these Polynesian pictures are probably the coolest things that I've seen so far come out of the Polynesian that I haven't owned already. I love this. Like, this is beautiful. Kind of reminds me of uh, Flight of Passage. I don't know why. This is gorgeous, though. This is another cool prop. This is a big canister that was actually out front of the milk stand at Galaxy Edge. That's crazy. Which one do you guys like, blue milk or green milk? They also have a lot more light fixtures from the Wilderness Lodge, including this one that goes above the bathroom sink. I like this. Look how fancy that is. And then they have those ones down there. And then some other knickknacks from the bathroom at the Wilderness Lodge. The trash can, the tissue boxes. These are only like 15, 20 bucks. I think that's kind of cool. These are really awesome because these are from the Polynesian. I don't know, I like the room art and like all the different prop art that they use at the resorts, but these ones are special because they're only $35 and on the back of them, they actually have the stamp approval from Disney. So you take a look, see right here, it says Disney World Ride Shared Services, Poly Resort Rehab, and then the date. That is so awesome, isn't it? That is really cool. These are kind of cool too. These are the temporary construction walls for downtown Disney. That's like a unique piece. Oh, and this is the uh, Grand Floridian wallpaper. Look, you can get a whole entire roll of wallpaper for 
$300, that's amazing. And it's got like Mickey and Minnie on him. There's a lot of good things in here. Some more cast member costumes up there. This is really cool. This is like one of those uh, separators from uh, Caribbean Beach in the Pirates room. A room separator. There you go. Yeah, I like that. Isn't that very cool? Lots more Wilderness Lodge stuff. I like the chairs. The chairs are only $75. And like these are very fancy. A very nice material. I like it a lot. Some more Christmas decorations came in. These are from the Hollywood Brown Derby. I like that. And then they got some boardwalk and some more from Disney Springs over there. Actually, right behind it, they have tons. Old Key West, Wilderness Lodge, Pop Century. They have them basically all from the resorts. And it goes back and, oh wow, so much more back here. That is so cool. These are the art of animation, actual, like, what are these called? Uh, garlands. Wow. I remember actually looking at these last year. That is crazy. Now we got some more banisters over here. Look at this. Disneyland Happy Thanksgiving 2015. That is really cool. And then over here they have uh, another get more happy at Disney's California Adventure. That's $195 for that banner. But then this one is actually $195 as well. <gasps> Wait a second. Happy New Year 2017. That's $195 too. These are really cool because these were in the parks and that like, man, if I was there 2017 for the new year, I would want that. It also looks like they have some Universal Studios props here too. Some newer ones that I haven't seen the last time I was here, including the Palace Arcade sign right there. That's really nifty. I don't know if this was here last time. Wow, $500, but that's really, that's, a, that's like a one-of-a-kind piece. And they have all of these other Halloween Horror Night prop signs, even some more over here. This is another cool Halloween Horror Nights prop. This is actually lights up, and it was uh, actually used at one of the bars where you can buy drinks. That's really nifty. It has like the photo to show you where it was at. Oh, it was also in a window. And I just noticed this peeking up there, but that is also another amazing thing. That is a wine sign from Epcot's Food and Wine Festival. Just the wine though, no food. Here is a couple of aprons from Restaurantosaurus at Animal Kingdom. This was the little dino restaurant. I like that. Look at how they have little dinosaurs on them. They have a lot of Animal Kingdom Lodge stuff. Basically this whole setup in this picture here. You can get the chairs for 65, the mirrors for 125, and they got tons of them. Tons of prop pictures over here. Stuff from Animal Kingdom, from All-Star Movies. Ooh, this is cool. This is from the grand opening of Animal Kingdom. Look at this. Mushu, Abu, Abu. I like these. And then Lumiere. A couple more of the Magic Kingdom Big Top Souvenirs props. That's really awesome because anything that's from the Magic Kingdom I feel like is like something awesome to have. You know what I mean? You'd be like, oh, that's from the Magic Kingdom. Or that's from Animal Kingdom. Look at that. They even have the dragon. I like those. Look, you can actually buy all the light up Halloween stuff that they have for this year already. I can't even believe that I paid $20 for a drink with that jack-o'-lantern light-up thing and I could have just got a bunch of them here. <laughs> I haven't seen those before either. Those are the Boulder Ridge nightstands. That's really nifty. These Polynesian desks though, these are going quick, $45. I would really love to get a desk or a Polynesian desk. I don't think I have any room though at my house for a desk. It would definitely be pretty awesome. They've got some really cool dressers back here. I like this one because it has a hidden Mickey in it. These are chairs, I believe, from Citrico's. And then this big thing right here is from the Yacht Club. Like, this is from the lobby. Oh, my Lord. I remember sitting here. What? That just blew my mind. Literally. This is where that TV was? That is crazy. Sorry, sometimes things like that just really hit me hard because I remember just sitting there and like joking around like watching like the little shows and stuff like that and now it's here. Mind blowing. And then take a look at this beautiful display here with all these awesome statues. Oh wow, these are unbelievable. I love it so much. 
I have never been a big snow globe collector kind of guy, but these are really fancy looking. Aladdin, and then they have the castles. Like this stuff is very nice, and these ears are very nice as well. That is an amazing Epcot one right there. All of World Showcase, and then even the 2000. That is something else, I can tell you that. Another really fancy thing is this old monorail set right here. I like it. I mean, this is old, old. Wow. And they even have the extra pieces too. That is something nifty. This is really cool. And these are actually very rare. This is a Disney Dune Buggy license plate. And this is an original one, $99. It's good that it's actually framed like that because if you put that in your car, somebody's bound to take it off maybe. Ooh. Wow, these are also really cool. These are actual like maps for uh, one of the Run Disney events. And this is old because it's got the Sorcerer's Hat, number one. And then you can look and it's got the show buildings. So, Rock and Roller Coaster. Wow, this is really cool. Echo Lake, Fantasmic. I like these. Wow, now I want to show you something so awesome. I think this is adorable. I have seen lots of Mickey and Minnie phones before, but I have never seen a Goofy phone. But take a look at this Goofy phone because it's really special. All you gotta do is lift it up and watch what happens. Oh, oh this is great. Oh, I just want to keep doing it. Oh, this is, this is amazing. Hello? Oh! Wow. It's only $89. Oh man, guys. $89. I don't have a landline. This is all. Oh, I don't know. I love how they actually put a lot of the stuff on the outside so you can get a good look of what the booth is going to be like. Like this one has all these vintage Mickeys. I have never seen a collection of Mickey plushes like this. Like they're all different. Look at that one. Wow. These are so nifty looking. I love just walking around here and just looking at all the boots. There's so much to take in and a little bit for everybody. Look at this little case right here. It's full of awesome old things. Big Boy, Elby's. I absolutely love this restaurant. I wish there was some still around. Maybe there is. If you guys know if they have any of those around still, I'd love to visit one in the future. Lots of Funko Pops too. I know that those are a very popular thing. And some nifty Lego sets. In fact, they have a lot of really cool things over here. More action figures. This is Paul's Hoarder House. I like that. <laughs> it's a hoarder house. They even have a lot of different paints. My mom would love this actually because she loved painting ceramics. Is that even a thing anymore? I remember I used to paint ceramics with my mom. Actually, now that I think about it, Mom, what did you do with all my ceramics I painted? Where are they? What did you do with all those? And I think that's going to do it for me. So much new stuff here. Lots more poly stuff. And it's going to keep on coming here, guys. It's going to keep coming. So if you don't get the Polynesian stuff right away, just keep checking back. Because, like I said, there's hundreds of rooms they're doing. So all that stuff is just going to keep on getting stocked up and stocked up. If you've seen anything you liked, like I said... Just give the Lakeland Antique Mall a call and I will put uh, their information in the description of this video. I'll also put it in the comments too, so that way it's easier for you to find. And I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. We'll see you next time. Bye.